well hello everybody welcome back to another graphic arc video uh today uh, i mean maybe i have one new video later on but uh, right now this quick video will be about some news as you can see right here we have a new driver version from intel which is 0.4314 and uh, let's see actually what it does uh, probably not much for gaming because right now they were fixing uh, as you can see here vulcan video extension support for avc and h avc decode and uh, as well for h264 which is uh yeah okay we will test this out i saw on discord channel about they were talking about this so uh, okay but as you can see no more uh game fixes in this one so uh yeah hmm. maybe we'll have to wait for a new driver but okay we got uh, not long ago uh, a new driver which was 0.4311 which really improved the uh, performance in lots of games so uh, that's good it's also good that they are working on something else as you can see but uh, okay guys not the main news that i wanted to show you right now was this <laughs> sparkle they are uh, announcing a new gpu intel arc series which are this big huge humongous one titan we have orc and elf i assume that uh, this three fan model should be a770 not a750 because uh, we saw what happened with a750 it still works fine in 1440p most of the time but uh, in the next one to two years uh, who knows uh, people will rather take a770 so uh, sparkle maybe you should reconsider getting this titan uh, model with three fans to be a770 it's okay just my opinion but up to you but the main thing okay we know the specifications are probably the same i mean we have an oc edition orc which is two fan and the titan which is three fan of a750 but the main thing i want to see is a380 elf let's check it out guys you know what i want to see i have here azrock in my hands uh, i'm not showing you because i don't have video cam yet but uh, it has eight power pin to power on but look at this guys compact and ready this one doesn't seem to have any PCIe power cable, which is uh, perfect. Nice, nice. I want to see this more graphic card A380 come out because the max wattage it takes is 55 watts. So I'm not sure why there's a cable. If you undervolt, you saw we even went below 30 watts. So uh, no point of having one more cable connected uh, if you don't really need it. So uh, yeah, I mean this is it for this news uh, let's quickly just check here uh, just to be sure if they don't really have oh uh, no no yeah it's not uh, there's no power output for this one except the uh, pci slot that gives out 75 watts i think so this will be mm, a buy for me probably i will buy this one if i can get it and we will do some test and compare between a uh, 380 azrock oc version and this one uh, i will probably skip uh, intel a750 titan version because uh, it's a750 i already have that we saw how it works but if they would make an a770 and maybe unlock voltage and uh, wattage who we can still do that of course with some uh, workarounds but if they would make it native uh, overclock support up to 300 watts that would be good but uh, who knows maybe the silicon is not allowing this to go intel would know more but uh, yeah guys uh, what do you think would you be getting uh, rather this uh, sparkle a750 or limited edition from intel or azrock oc1 let me know down in the comments below I know probably what the answer will be where's a770 we want a770 let's go <laughs> yeah i know i know thermal sync what is this it's thermal sensor can detect temperature changes and adjust the color of its led light bar accordingly ah so they will be putting some uh, fancy rgb effects as well not as uh, shiny as intel a770 is but uh, okay i mean at least you know what kind of temperature you're getting and uh, actually they are quite spot on with the temperature here showcasing under 100 percent load on a750 you get about 75 uh, c i mean if you ramp up the fan speed it's less but uh, it also depends on the silicon so uh, yeah that's it for this video uh i should hope that they will announce a770 
and uh, yeah make sure to like subscribe you know the drill support me i support you by making more videos so you know what you we are getting into with intel arg graphic cards in this uh, 2023 i can't really wait what battle match it brings so uh, yeah see you guys in the next one